it's the inside of Olsen. Yeah, we sure are. You know, we're not going to give up until the very last heat's over with. But, uh, you know, we're all concerned in the pits here. There's not much we really can do. You know, as much as we tell them to keep on going and try harder, they're doing the best they can. But, like I said, it's just not good enough, you know. Oh, Pendle's up. I've made a tremendous start. Pendle leads it. Cradley's really the only team I, I want to ride for, but uh, if we can't agree terms, we can't agree terms. Looks to the outside. Olsen hugs the inside. Olsen comes along. It's a right to the fight, to the line. And it's... Oh! It's Pennell. Pennell has made another of his jet-propelled starts. Pennell leads it. Lee is second. Go. Oh, what a race. Pennell again swinging outside. Can he find the drive? I don't know if he's going to make it. Or is he? Up on the line. And he's just moved Pennell. Oh, what a ride. Right, he hasn't dropped any points yet, and he's uh, he's coming out of the start like just a gang of bandits, you know. So uh, I've got a pretty good starting position, so hopefully, I, hopefully, I can get to the first corner first, and I'll be away. And it is Pedal, and on the inside there it is Autry, who gave him a nudge and can it. Well, I've got just as good as chances as anybody right now. I feel confident. I've had a good year, my best year uh, in my lifetime. Big view from high at the back. So away they go. And it is tremendous start. Pennell leads it. And Penhall is now coming up and challenging. Penhall, who won the Master of Speedway title on the continent. Going round on the outside in third place, it's set up back. Fourth place, it's Billy Sanders. And look at Penhall come through on the inside. He's easing Larry Ross away. He comes through on the inside. If you're in heat eight. And from the outside there, it's Pennell made a colossal start from the outside. The outside grid really does look like jet lightning. Oh, it's a tremendous start. And it's uh, Pennell who gets away up to the corner. And on the outside there, it is Michael Lee. Pennell leads it. Lee goes around the outside. And it's getting a bit greasy. No question about that. Collins now bursting down the inside of Pennell. And oh, it's a nudge out there. Move over, Bruce. He said, I'm coming through. And Bruce Pennell can hardly be taking less interest. And that really is quite a gesture by Pennell. I still have two really hard heats, and uh, I've got to cross my fingers and hope everything goes all right for the last two. Pennell and Knudsen, full throttle, together around the outside. It's Pennell, it's Pennell to the line. Or is it? Is it Knudsen? It's Pennell! Everything went great today, and uh, I, I could have done it by myself. My sponsors and my mechanics and everybody else were just fantastic. Rick. Side. And so too it is Hollingworth from the inside. And Hollingworth gave them all a knock as Pedro goes around the outside. It's leading is Hollingworth. And we've got some tremendous speed at the moment. Hollingworth leads it. Look at Bruce Pedro go. I don't think so. I think we're going to come back pretty good. Uh, it's just myself that's slipping a little bit. The rest of the boys are plugging in nice and nice and hard. So we'll just have to see the end of the last heat. As the impatient one. And away they go. And it's Pedal from the outside. Cuts across the field. Pedal leads at second place. Is Shearer. Then. Uh, I'll tell you, it's fantastic. Uh, I, I can't even believe our team tonight. They all, every single one of the boys, put in 110%. And I'm so happy for them because our confidence has been down a little bit, but now it's back up, and uh, we're on our way to winning that league. It just shows you tonight. As they went over the line, but a 4-2 heat win is good enough for Cradley, and just look at the way Bruce Pedal's loving it. In front, the Carter has roared around the outside, and into him goes Pedal, and they're both in trouble, and they're going to go down through the fence. In goes Carter, and in two goes Pennell. Something really had to give there. And it is Hank again. He's made a tremendous start. And Pennell going around the outside of him. And I think uh, John Hack wasn't aware that it was his partner, Bruce Pennell, but now he is. Thank you, Bruce. Thank you. And it was uh, Pennell from the inside who shot across and carved everybody up. It yeah, I know that there's 15 riders out there going like hell, and I better guess it. And just as we rather thought it might happen, Moran it is who jumps out, and going way out onto the board, it is Bruce Pedal, Pedal and Major, and Pedal is stopped. Pedal's in trouble there, that's Hawkins bad luck. Bruce Pedal, what about that heat from your point of view? Not very good, obviously. Is he a patient by the way this time? And from the inside of the hole, and from the outside it is... Pedal and Schwartz
goes under him is Barley. And Shearer has not made the start. It's Pamela who's got away from the outside. Shearer is second in third place. It is Collins. And the world champion, just as we suspected, would find that extra little bit of all just when it came and he's in front. Well, Bruce Pennell, you've just been geeing up your, your teammates. What did you say to them? Well, I think they're geeing me up more, Gary. They're uh, they're holding up really good for us right now. So we're going to have an American world champion. It's going to be Bruce Pennell going over the line on his back wheel. There he goes. And Pennell it is. The people's choice for champion. Bruce Pennell from the United States of America is the pin-up world speedway champion of 1981. That probably was the longest race of my whole life. <laughs> and there is Peter Adams' his team boss. And now the celebrations begin. Well, it's good you're here with us uh, today, but you had a bit of a job getting here and you forgot your passport. What's been happening? Boy, I feel like a rookie traveler. I did. I, well, actually, I, everything was in such a hustle bustle. I was only here for a few hours and then I took back off and I left my passport in, in Birmingham and... I kind of had to get in here hiding under the trunk in the boot of the car. You're in the boot of Peter Adams' car, so I mean, what yeah. happened? You went through I think that's three what, checkpoints. I was more nervous <laughs> then than I had been when I was racing, so it was pretty tough. Because he's such a wonderful ambassador, such a great image-conscious rider, a showman, and really a tremendously popular world speed supremo. Yeah, that's the way it goes, I guess, you know, there's uh, ups and downs in Speedway. Left, I think. Left at the start, and got away. At the back. Well, I'll tell you what, uh, Dave, I've got a hell of a lot of butterflies, but uh... myself, I've got quite a hectic schedule, and I'm just going to make it. If all my connections are right, then I'll be there on time. I've got to have a helicopter uh, fly me in because I'll be in Germany the day before practicing. But. Uh... has made the jump and so too has Moran and from the outside Hack has gone as well but Pennell shreds them up right, right across the first corner and I feel good I uh, just missed the start a little bit in that first heat and saw she rode and go and away they go and it's Pennell in front Pennell moving out and Collins Collins has swung out and Carter's back in last place well it was getting pushing and shoving and elbows neither rider giving anything away and well, I wouldn't like to be the referee to call that one. Well, we had about three or four tussles earlier in the night, and you know, I mean, what am I supposed to do? Let him shut off, let him go by? Bruce Lee Pennell defend his crown, he's away clear, and surely they're not going to catch him now. And Bruce Pennell, with a Hollywood career in front of him, is going to win the title for the second time in a way that Hollywood would hardly have scripted. I feel great. Unbelievable. I can't believe it, you know? I mean, uh, what happened earlier is what happened. There's not a lot I can say about it. They can't take this away from me, though. I'm world champion again. Balloon grid two, and this time they get clear, and it's Crump who gets away, and we look for Pennell to come around the outside. Pennell trying to find the drivers. Crump leads it. Here comes Pennell down the boards. He's got around. A really brave, bold piece of cornering from Pennell. Bruce Penhall of the United States, the world champion in Speedway for 1982. Oh, I don't know what the heck it is, you know, I'm just getting beat, that's all there is to it. I'm a mess and I'm missing the start, but uh, I'm still in there trying as much as I can. Speedway, Speedway's been great to me and... I don't feel you're just a bit naughty. Yeah, a bit.